Okay, welcome to the second part of the course. All right, in this part, we're going to just quickly work on the login screen, the login screen for our application. Now, but with the UI that we have here in Figma, we don't have the login screen at all, all right? So um, we're just going to go ahead and then uh, create a login screen using uh, the templates found within Flutterflow. So to do that, just click on the new page and then instead of clicking create blank or generate with AI, just go ahead and click on Auth, that's authentication, all right? And then we'll just scroll down, I'll use something uh, familiar. I just clicked on that, so this is what I clicked on, use my template, and then change this name to maybe login or any other name that you want to call it. Click on create page. Then I'll click on this, uh, this image to delete it then inside this row i'll click on this to add a text i'll call the text uh, grocery grocery app all right this is a cool name and then i will go ahead and change this to 700 uh change this to maybe 38 just to make it big and then click on this to change the color to white all right, so we're good with this now. What I'm gonna do is I'll just go ahead and, and delete this. So I just selected that and deleted it. Then click on this as well, delete it. Uh, we will fix this later. Okay, so let's leave this, all right? So then um, let's click on this and delete all of this too. All right, and then uh, delete this now. Okay, great. So we have the sign up here. And uh, at the beginning, I believe you must have noticed that you had some errors and we still have errors here so we will fix those errors i i don't have to check them to know the errors that are there so the errors are definitely going to be uh first of all let's click on the text field we need to give a max line here as one at least uh then here we need to give another here and then we click on the sign up part the same thing click on the text field max line one uh, password max line one as well so now we have uh, our errors have been reduced we just need to go ahead and then um, okay we didn't really need to put for email address the first part here just for passwords so now we need to click on this create account and uh, delete the action so I'm just gonna go ahead and delete the action okay so we delete the action so that's gone and click back on this click on this click on action and delete the action that that came with the template so the thing is uh some actions came with the template so we just deleted it now we are good we don't have any errors anymore so um there's some things that i would like us to do let's click on this and go to um label properties uh, we can just take this off all right so label properties then um this one we can just uh remove the label property too yeah so it's just gonna make it neater all right so now we have it like this so i'll click on this and remove the uh label property all right just delete it and then here just scroll down as well look for label property and take it off okay good now we have this we have our login screen for our application now we need to change the color to this particular color so um this is it uh let me see show more colors this is a color that we need to copy i just copied it i need to click on the container here so this is a container that has all of these colors right so we need to just locate it uh okay now that's not giving me the okay so where is the color logo container container okay so the login screen itself the entire scaffold all right so it's not like the container it's just the entire scaffold has a color so we can just go ahead and then just put this here and boom that's it so now we have these color scenario here let's change this one to to the color of the the text in this button to the same color that we used there so i'll come here and paste it okay so now that's like it let's come over here to the sign in part and then i'll click on this change the color as well okay and then i think that's it
So uh, this particular one, I think we will just take it off. For the password, we'll just take it off. Okay, so this is good. All right, so uh, we have these uh, set up now and it's pretty neat, okay? So I believe this is perfect for you as well because it is perfect for me. We'll get to see in the second, the next part of this course. See you soon.